year, we want to determine whether the given lines are parallel, perpendicular, or neither. Recall it is the slope of the line that determines whether it's parallel, perpendicular, or neither. And when you're given the equation in standard form, step one would be to first rewrite it in slope intercept form. We'll start with line one. So to get it in slope intercept form, meaning solve for y, I'm going to first subtract x from each side, then divide by negative 3. What you do to 1, you do to all. Once we simplify that, we can see that we have our equation in slope intercept form and that our slope is 1 third. Now line 2 is already in slope intercept form, so all we need to do here is simply take a look at our slopes and determine whether these slopes are parallel, perpendicular, or neither. Which would you say it is? That's correct, it's neither. So it can't be parallel because parallel lines, uh, they have the same slope and these numbers are not the same. Perpendicular, it's not perpendicular because one uh, of the numbers would need to be negative. Remember, negative reciprocals, um, yes, we do have one that's flipped. So they have that reciprocal thing going on, but we do not have uh, one that's negative. And that is why it falls in the category of neither.